Hey there, welcome to the stream. Uh, hey there, welcome to the stream. Oh, Joe's definitely working on the stream. Thanks very much. <laughs> uh, we're again with uh, Sunhaven tonight. A uh, nice chillax uh, stream after Pal World and Monster Hunter World over the last couple of days. So, yeah, well, let's get straight back into it. Welcome, hello, and let's just see if this uh, stream just pops up. Yeah, it does. So, um, obviously, there's been a few issues with the stream and avatars over the last couple of days, um, with it slowing down and, and doing stuff. So, I've done a few little settings in the background. So, as we're playing, just you know, just tell me if it's any better or anything like that, or because I don't really notice these things. Um, you know, sometimes I will, sometimes I want to, you know, it just depends because I'm looking at a mobile, mobile's like that big. I'm only looking at the mobile for chat. I haven't got enough monitor here to, to visualize it. So if it's any better, please tell me. Um, yeah, yeah, be, uh, so a few little settings in the background. So hopefully that's helped it. Uh, so yeah. I've, we've not played this for a while now, so kind of got what? I think we'd just, um, Start of that elf farm. If it, yeah, I remember. Yeah, okay. <laughs> right. So we need to really go back and um, uh, kind of like do this in a, in, a, in another day, really. Uh, I can't even remember what we were doing here. Right. Yeah, that's the thing. Now, so we got two farms on the go. Um, it's gonna, it's a little bit awkward to kind of remember what to do. Oh, it was the, what's it, L? L. It's me pressing J. We're still going to find our way through the fog, which is the other city, I think, which we'll do that soon. And that way we'll have three farms on the go, I think. I think that's what that fog leads you to, is another city and another farm. And I'm not too sure. And, um, yeah, let's, let's, like, let's do a few missions in here, but we, we do have to remember to go back as well. Uh, oh yeah, let's see if this is loads of mana, doesn't it? Yeah. I remember now. What else was we making? We was making any um We were making we were making oh wow. We we're making any we were making anything for health? A bit of health would help. We could make some we got, what have we got in our, oh, we've got health. Okay, now we're, we're fine then. All right, well, let's go then. We had to get loads of chest already, don't we? Because we had so much crap. There's no point in doing it now because it's oh it's bedtime so okay um, <clears throat> so let me just see also it says something about um the size of these as well like elo and stitch is pretty high so let me just see if i can go into the back end of that and then uh, just quickly maybe change that i'm not too sure if i can or not There you go, well, Owen. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's what it was on. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay, then. What about that? Yeah, okay, that might be a compromise. A little bit down, a little bit on the scale. Don't want to make it too bad. Okay. There we go. All right. It should be better now. Okay. Uh, was we farming anything? We were, but we haven't got anything. We got anything to farm? No. Right, okay. Um, 
Get me uh, keys where I can I go. some trees before uh... get as many resources as we can Welcome Polly Sharon. Uh, hiya Polly. Uh, playing uh, Sunhaven tonight. Nice chillax. Uh, I don't think you've ever seen this one on the channel, but we're we're like deep into this. Um, we 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 sh we did start this at the beginning of the year. We've we we've streamed it a few times now. Um, but you should get right into it. To be honest with you. Uh, okay. What's well, maybe we can? Do I don't know what to really do now on this. To do air skip, we cast twice a single jump. Uh, okay, I think maybe the lumberjack thing, additional rare materials. I think that could be good. For the first time, I didn't forget my laptop open somewhere. <laughs> So also, um, obviously, um, Ella one was telling me that the uh, the avatars were a bit laggy yesterday. Um, so I'm hopefully I've changed a few of the settings in the background. Um, so hopefully that it's not so bad tonight. But if it is lagging on your side as or anyone's side, just, uh, give me a uh, yeah if you could tell me if it is or isn't because yeah there's not i don't you know because again it's i'm brand new to do it i'm doing i'm, I'm brand new to the the, the program um I, i'm like learning like like all the different settings on it so but i've upped the frame rates on it i've um minimized the windows on it i've made it um so it's uh, in the background as well um it's oh damn it passed out i was right there as well uh yeah it was it was laggy like yesterday but i thought it was my bad wi-fi oh no 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 hello uh, one told me and um, so i think it was something to do with there were quite a few people on yesterday as well wasn't there so i have read that if, if it get like if, if it gets over like maybe 10 or 20 people it can be pretty laggy um no obviously we didn't get to that but we got to around about five people yesterday i think it was about five um and it was pretty laggy um so it it, it it is a lot of different things it could be like drivers it could be the program it could be the game that i'm playing as well um so it could be a lot of different things so like i said i've I changed i changed the frame rate on it um yeah we were across it to be honest with you um so yeah, I've changed the frame rate on it. Um, I've, I've put the process in the back of windows as high as it was just in normal. So it gives it a bit more bandwidth as well. So hopefully that'll just, you know, if a lot of people come on it, um, I'm thinking as we're getting more popular, and I've said this to LON, things like Pando and things like the, the, the thing that uh, the avatars, they might have to eventually go because if it makes the stream laggy, <laughs> then that's not what we want is it we want a good stream um and something ha might have to just replace that obviously we want the stream to be entertaining and we want you guys to have fun in the background while you're just watching as well you know what i mean that's the whole point you know what i mean so it, it, it's it's it, it's a compromise on can we get these settings perfectly dialed in and hopefully that it's not an issue you know what i mean and it and we can go forward with that and if not then we'll have to look at something else so but yeah hopefully it's not an issue okay we got this right okay 
So. But okay, let's go and do. Um, uh, yeah, okay, let's go and speak to this air mage. And then what we'll do is we'll travel back uh, to our other farm. So we've, we've got two farms uh, now. Uh, with that, we're kind of really far into this game. Um, you start off as like um, as a farmer. Oh, duh. <laughs> uh, but uh, you start... Where the hell's this guy? Yeah, you start off as a farmer, but um, you basically you don't know anybody. You're brand new to the town and all that kind of stuff. Um, and you, you start working for the actual thing, but there's like um, a dark element. Um, and you've got to like go and explore it. It's like world dragons and all this kind of stuff. There's a lot of like storyline to this. Obviously, staying awake in this game is it challenging? All the mushrooms look super beautiful. How am I staying awake? Yeah, the game's actually really challenging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the combat's actually really good on it. I mean, some of it is a bit tedious, like any farming game. You know what I mean? Um, you know, you, you know, like the mining and stuff like that. Like, but there is combat down in the mines as well, so it, it kind of breaks up the monotony of just mining rocks. Um, the storyline's actually really pretty good. The combat on it's pretty good. There's got a lot of funny moments in this game as well. And we're in a new village as well, so we've got all different new missions as well. We've kind of done the first farm missions. There is a few little missions there if we go back, but not a lot. Uh, we're kind of repeating the same stuff again now, so I'm glad that actually a new, a new farm's actually opened up. And we've still got enough of farms to go look at as well and, and open up. With this, there's a couple of cities and a couple of villages, so you're not just stuck on one village. It's quite an uh, in, in-depth game, actually. Uh, hello there, what's the show if I see you again? Are uh, you from the Navari? Yeah, my family has lived here for years, been here for the Grand Tree. We were in there before... Uh, Enough elves to make the sea you live under the grand tree. Of course, you won't find me living in the branches. I'm no tree frog, you know. Okay, elves have welcomed you. Well, certainly, they're gracious souls. The elves, quite a few of my folk have found wonderful lives here. Something about this place feels like home. So, Lee and Marby get along with well, the elves, absolutely. Though I'll say I've been some tension between me and the bug of Marby. My free flexors kicked in when I met Bianca. Oh yeah, I've met her. She's literally a bee. And yeah, we don't talk much. Okay, whatever. Yeah, yeah, there's definitely, yeah, there's so... You've seen a griffin before when we came out. That'll now take us back to our original farm. Uh, we've, we've only just got this one, like, opened up. So you can do, like, little missions here. These are, like, little things, like, you know, get some lightning in the bowl and, you know whatever this is you know what i mean you, and you'll get like xp and orbs and stuff like that like i said we've only just moved into this village and uh, so we we really need we like you know we need to like do a lot of the stuff and uh, we got with like mad characters like this bee character like and there's all sorts of flower pot character there there's this guy caspian there's all sorts of crazy characters you can farm animals you can raise them you can breed them it, it it's like a really like like it kind of like a stardew but like um i would say i mean again and i've not played a lot of stardew um but like this is like more of like a like a fantasy kind of stardew in a way Van, hello there, Chrono. You, you're here because Nirvana asked you to come, aren't you? Godwin told me anything about your lesson on perspective, along with my place in it. Uh, there's a lot I can learn from Nirvana's lesson here in Navari, but also I know there's a lot more you can learn from outside of Navari. Navari can teach you a lot, but at the same time, don't feel held back. Do you know what I mean? I'll tell you what, this is my test. I've hidden something just outside of Navari. If you find it, you'll pass my test. It, it'll be easy for sure. I'm sure. Oh, I found it. Just outside, he said, didn't he? It's just literally just outside. Yeah, it, it, to be honest with you, yeah, like I am, I'm obviously started it. Um, I think it was just, um, like, like just getting onto uh, uh, January. Um, obviously, I know you were busy, so you did miss, um, like, basically all of this uh, series. <laughs> but it's it's super fun to catch into, and like I said, it, it, it's got a bit of everything. It's got a bit of alchemy. It's got a bit of magic. It's got, you know, it's got crafting. It's got mining. It's got fishing. It's got romances. You know, it's got a good storyline to it. So it, it's a lot of everything. Um, yeah, it was the exam week, yeah. Uh, oh, hi, Doug God. Uh, welcome to the chat. 
I can see you feeding, feeding Pando, so I think you're in the chat. <laughs> ah, well, that wasn't hard, was it? <laughs> was that it? Like, come on, that was. Oh my god, was that it? That wasn't hard, was it? Oh, go and find my thing. Like, okay. Like, really? Dude, that wasn't even a challenge. Found it already, did ya? Oh, I thought I hid in it. Well, did ya? Did you, did you really? <laughs> All right, Colonel. Seems you passed my test. Well done. I'll leave you with this. Nirvana told me Godwin's prepared a set special task for you. Best of luck with your lessons and wising and with wising up. Uh, thanks for letting me know. All right, I gotta speak to Godwin. The hell's Godwin? Like, I honestly, I'm gonna assume this out a little bit. I know, I just see, I don't know anyone around this new new place. Uh, I'm guessing I'll just go past them, like I just did then. I'm not too sure Godwin actually is. Speak to Godwin the Elder. Oh, he might be the old guy. Maybe, I'm not too sure. Might be in here. Uh, right in there. Uh, Duck Garden Quark. Uh, I weighed myself the other day and lost three kilograms in just over a week. Oh, congrats, mate. Yeah, I think I can get up this way. Wind lifts. Hey, it was the old guy. I remembered. <laughs> Hello, Chrono. How's she training with Navarra? I can't remember it, to be honest with you, mate. It was like last week. I've played Monster Hunter World and Power World since then. I don't know. <laughs> I think it was okay. Oh, I'm sorry, Chrono. I wasn't expecting you to be part of the lesson. Fan is quite far, fond of his pranks, as usual. Ho, ho. But you were here, so let me tell you this, Chrono. There are so many who live in Navari, and each of them feels the same way. They are equally valid to me. Some value hiding from the world. I respect their reasons why. Others wish to see the world and brave potential threats outside. I do not discourage them either. Okay. I am the elder and all perspective must not be known to me but acknowledged it's something my younger princess wesley is having trouble grasping but i still remember when i was young myself i believe in his ability to understand the value of perspectives and i believe in yours as well as for your special task huh well how about this return to nirvana and tell her i sent you my greetings oh is that it dude like you got me running an hour like a dick <laughs> <laughs> oh god's sake man um, yeah how we all doing polly doing fine how are you duck i am good thanks good to hear good to hear um oh where this dragon thing is is it uh do we hold on a minute can i uh so i gotta oh right okay i think i've got to go out here and then around the sides i think so like so yeah so as i said this is a new village for me but there's like um there's darkness seeping into it and that's the same as the original village that i started in as well some kind of darkness these like guardians are like they're like sleeping all the time um and they shouldn't be they're like uh like they, they need energy called mana which i somehow i'm able to just produce where these are elves they actually have to like like actually like kind of like mine it in a way uh yeah nice of you proud of you it helps you lose your more weights healthily yeah no it's good mate it's three kilos in the wheat it's not nothing to be sniffed at I would just have the um like like in anything in life i would just have a, like a positive outlook on it um 
congratulate yourself when you do lose weight and if you don't lose weight don't be so hard on yourself you know what i mean because that's when you can go oh you know i should be doing this and i should be doing this and go to the extremes and i think if you just naturally do what you're doing now like you said you, you know you you you, you tone down a bit on your eating you a bit more exercise and all that and it would just naturally come off and come down you know what i mean and having a bit of weight on you it, it's not like you know as long as you're healthy then that's the main thing you know uh, welcome back bono how was your time with iris and van i'm frank me but the elder go and sent his greetings uh you catch the fairest glimpse of a grin on the world dragon's eyes uh though her composer reigns otherwise completely intact uh have a past lesson first i wish to ask you one more thing for god's sake who do i have to talk to now <laughs> what is your perspective should navari stay exclusive or unhidden or should navari open itself to the world Hmm. Uh, well, I don't even. I mean, I don't know why you're hidden in the first place. What have you got to hide? That's the thing, isn't it? It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. I don't want to be blown away by its light breeze. No, I, 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 don't, I mean, I'm not saying that. I think it's always nice to, you know, like say to yourself, like, I, like I said, three kilograms is not nothing to be sneezed at, um, and and especially if it's hard for you to lose weight as well. Uh, to be honest with you um, so I think it's, it's something to go and be pr actually proud of like because it's the start in a way you can think of it as the start I've lost three kilograms th this week but let's say next week and you don't lose nothing and you're doing exactly the same things that you've done the first week I wouldn't be too like oh do you know what I mean oh it's not working I'll I'll try this thing no just continue along the path that what you're doing now that's what I'm trying to get at in a way um, but yeah also you have got a point there not to be like overly overly excited but it, it, you know you should be happy with yourself and go well I'll, because it, again even to lose three kilograms in a week is it, it's some for some people that's impossible it's it's hard to do you know what i mean um and and for a number of reasons you know what i mean they have, obviously they're not having enough exercise or the diet isn't correct or they're doing all that and it's and it's literally just the metabolism as you get older our metabolism slows down it's really hard to lose weight and a lot, that's why a lot of um like like anime and again you know um young people as well but a lot of mostly a lot of overweight people or obese people go for like um the operation for the gastric band and stuff like that to help them out actually lose weight fast because that's the only option that they have uh, sometimes it's not a bad i think gaining weight still also it can be muscles not bad yeah i would agree polly uh definitely um it, it's not a bad thing to have weight um especially if it's like muscular weight and again that's another thing we're going to touch on as again as we get older we actually do well, our muscle mass goes down so it's actually better to have a, a nice bit of muscle mass and how do you get muscle mass well you have to have a bit of you have to have a little bit of fat to turn that fat into muscle mass um so it, it's all about um balance uh, like in anything in life yeah i was getting out of breath uh, i apologize so i had something had to be jumped that was true yeah you was you was in kind of a bad way weren't you ducky mate um you know what i mean like you, you you'd even talk to me about it uh, you know um i'm, I'm, I'm basically said you know like, i really need to do something um, and i but I, and i i said to you there and then but at least you're doing something at least you went to the doctors at least you had something a vision of what to do you weren't just sitting there and going well it's my time now i've done what i <laughs> you know what i mean like i might as well just go out with a bank like a lot of people do that as well they're thinking well there's no point like i've, I've had a good life you know what i mean like it is what it is i'm not going to change you know and a lot of people do do that so at least you've had the the, the right frame of mind to go no i've got something to contribute i, I want to stay around i've got something to live towards and and i want to i want to actually change um I think again that's a positive for me because you've got that right right frame uh set of mind and again that's something that you can actually tap yourself on the back and go well yeah I, at least i did something I, you know what i mean and, and that stage of my life because again a lot of people don't a lot of people just leave it uh so what is perspective uh, what what should we do here? should we open up this village or should we remain it hidden to the whole world what do you reckon chats open up this 
mysteriously hidden village that was hard to find or open it up to the world don't forget though there is evil outside of this world but it is already seeping in to this to this um to this hidden village so whether they open whether they open it or not i think um the evil will get to them open up the borders all right that's it <laughs> open itself up i see opening one itself of the world comes with many possibilities for opportunity but also risk true i've just said that i wonder if it if you would have answered the same the way i'd asked you before you began this lesson please reflect on what you've spoken to and i've told you try to understand that respect it i think i have you have well done a little spout on your first lesson complete i hope you now understand the important of perspective now then uh when are you prepared to learn the next lesson come see me all right cool it, yeah, it's a flare. <laughs> oh my god, I thought it was a giant flower. I just realized it was dragon. Yeah, it's a world dragon. Uh, yeah, it's so cool of design. It is really is cool. Uh, I think I'm going to go for fishing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we're ready now. We're, we're ready right now. Give me the next mission. Yeah, it's a, it, it. I mean, look at it. You can't actually tell really, but then there is a face over there with all like the, the, the little like the lilies and the roses and stuff like that. The, 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 the actual wing is amazing. Look how, how good that wing is. It's like so like mystical. <laughs> uh, are you prepared? to begin your next lesson chrono yeah i'm ready already everyone sees the world through their own perspective a single perspective is only a single way of seeing the world true many perspectives lead to a more complete understanding no matter how different something or someone is uh, you can find a commonality with it if you're willing to look and uh, most of the citizens of the valley are welcoming of your presence but what but what about one who is not i know who they are chrono seek them when you've reached the commonality, come back to me. Are you talking about Wesley? <laughs> yeah, he does not like me, I'm telling you. <laughs> oh, was it so obvious? No, it was Wesley who I spoke of. The violent eyes are narrow slightly and a soft snort escapes from his snout or laugh. I know how the old assistant can some can think sometimes and how he feels. Regardless of my misgivings about you might harbour approach Wesley with a willingness to see his perspective, you will find you have more in common than either of you may think you should be able to find him in the tavern of the old tree at the moment okay i'll give it a shot all right <laughs> i used to be similar mindset about going out with a bang you see when i'm about 28 and here i am not feeling great half the time yeah when i was younger i thought i i you know i didn't in my life was a very different life than it is now um and you know like i had like thoughts of not being here in a way <laughs> you know what i mean and i think that's quite reasonable for a lot of people but i come to assume to the realize i had a lot to offer um uh, you know a lot of people like that liked me um once i realized that it kind of like changed my perspective on things um and uh, the one thing i was able to do a lot of the time was communicate with people i had that like natural talent of just like talking um which actually helped me in life a little bit <clears throat> but once i had but when i was young i didn't realize i had that talent so and i was kind of alone and, and very lonely as well and then um, so i didn't really get out a lot um so i was I, I obviously depression had hit and all that kind of but i didn't realize that when i was when i was a lot younger uh so i mean and naturally you're gonna have these like you know darker thoughts in a way you know what i mean um you know but once i realized that was all in my head and actually that wasn't true life became a lot easier and a lot better for me you you made your decision to be healthier you put the effort and time in and by things will get better you can do it Doug. yeah it's true it's true polly's got absolutely the right set of mind there you if you can put your if you put your mind to it <coughs> and don't let anything deter you you can definitely do it everyone in this chat you can achieve anything you want a positive five zone yeah it's true. i i totally agree if you put your mind to it you can achieve anything you want in this life i was always told that you know what i mean uh it, 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 it should like it's actually just doing it but i think if you have that positive mindset every day and push yourself as well because you 
the, the only person that can push you is you. Like, people can give you a, a bit of a cheer on, and people can motivate you, but the only real person that can actually do it is you. And, and, and that's the thing, if you, if you want to do it, you will do it. If you have that positive mindset, yeah, I will do this, but and I don't want to put a time set up, time set on it because that, I mean that's the, the hardest thing if you say I want to be this in like two years time you're putting that pressure on you <laughs> if you just say I want to be doing this and I'm just going to do it every day and see how that gets me I think that's a more of a healthier way to do it <laughs> because then you're not putting pressure on yourself Wesley huh uh, what do you want to talk to me for? <laughs> uh, okay, Wesley. Uh, commonality? Huh. Listen, I don't have time for something like that. Besides, it's a bad idea anyway. Uh, people talk shit about anything anyway. It's a point thing is what you think. Yeah, it's true. It's true. <laughs> Yeah, never, never, like, you know, never, uh, I, like, it, it's good to listen to people, but the, again, and um, sometimes listening to people can help you. But again, like, I like Polly saying, a lot of people do talk shit about anything anyway. And the, and the most important thing is, is how you feel. And like you said, it, 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 again, like, and you did feel like, like, you know, like you, you couldn't cope and you needed help and you, and you reached out for help, you know, and now you've got the advice and you're putting things in place and it's step by step. You know what I mean? There's three kilograms this week. It could be, you know, two kilograms next week, one kilograms next week, not kilograms that. You know what I mean? Like, and it's just about just steadily carrying on, being in that healthy frame of mind, and 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 actually just pushing yourself to do it. Yeah, and it's all about willpower as well. It's just like kind of like if you want to quit smoking, it's like you know what I mean. It, no one can do it for you yeah, other than you. It's about that willpower to put the cigarette down. It's the exact same with losing weight. <laughs> Yes, yes, we need to listen to the right people exactly. Uh, you know yourself more than yourself after all, that's true. Uh, that's, I agree, yeah. I think everyone agrees with that. Right, you can train with Nevada all you want, but uh, I have work to do. Oh, that's understandable. Seems like Wesley isn't going to make this easy. Go figure, maybe the elder could provide some advice with this task. Maybe he's in the council room. God damn it, I'm going to go back to the council room again. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm running back and forth here. Oh, hello there, Chrono. Do you need something with me? What's the deal with Wesley? Ah, I cannot tell you. I didn't think this moment would come. Ho, ho. Wesley has a lot to worry about. Uh, though perhaps it's just an exercise, it's an excuse I make for him. He admittedly has a few things to learn in order to become an elder. Uh, okay, how come someone like Wesley? Uh, what do you see in Wesley? That's a fair question. One I bear responsibility to answer. Where's the case deeply for the valid traditions? Deeper than anyone else, including myself, more than anything. Wesley wants to watch Navali and all of its people thrive. The way he seeks to accomplish this, however, is through long-standing tradition, some which is not aged well, it seems. <coughs> that's better, that's better. So we're there, we're having a positive stream in a chat, yeah. Well, I, I mean... That's the good thing about um, you know uh, communities, you know what I mean, or anything that you can join. It's about, I think, it's about positivity and having fun. And yes, if you again, if you feel like you need to chat, and the people like ourselves are, are chatting, it, it yeah, uh, I think it's only a positive thing. I took a much needed uh, three day break from FM. I'm just playing it too much and it was really getting me rattled. Although I can relate to that, Ducky, mate. I mean, I, that's why I stopped playing it a long time ago. I mean, there was one time in my life I played FM that much. I, I honestly didn't come out of my room for six months. And this was obviously when I was a bit younger and um, when I was still living with my mum and dad. Um, you know what I mean? Obviously, them times have gone, but six months. I stayed upstairs, I didn't come down, I didn't speak to anybody. And that's how much I was into that game. I was one of them guys that would like um like print out spreadsheets about the players and everything. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I was so into it, I couldn't see like anything else. Like, you know what I mean? Like I'd have to get food 
brought up to me, water brought up to me, like, you know, I wasn't the cleanliest of people as well, like, because I was just so into it, I'd just, like, lay in my bed all day and then I'd get up and then play FM. Well, obviously, chat manager back in the day, but same thing, really. Uh, it wasn't, uh, wasn't long I've not played like it for 10 years. I, th I think, yeah, that's another thing. Like, I think you, once you, like, say you've not played something for so long. Like, I was out of PC gaming for quite a while um, because I didn't have a PC. Uh, I couldn't afford a PC. Um, and obviously, it went into console gaming because it was a lot cheaper to have a console. And then once I, once, like, you know, I'd um, got married to Elowin and, and stuff like that. Um, it was like settled down kind of thing and it was like i want to i want to build a pc i want to get back into pc gaming and i did do that uh, and then like you know i've never looked back from pc gaming actually you know what i mean but i don't play a lot of games and i just haven't got the time for it um and that's why i stream now so i can actually play games and you know what i mean it's just having a bit of fun as well because playing games on your own is good and I don't, i'm not actually one for multiplayer games but i i like you know like, like this is like you know i don't mind doing this and streaming it to you guys i think that's kind of multiplayer in a way <laughs> do you know what i mean in my head i'm playing a multiplayer game right now because i've got you guys on chat so yeah uh corwin when i selected him as my princess he was full of hope and eagerness ho 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 but now I worry that Don Fears have turned him sour. Perhaps I failed at being scared to guide when he needed it. I'm sure it wasn't your fault. Wesley has so much to learn. I have much to teach him. Perhaps it's time he learned something truly important. Ah, uh, yeah, Chrono. Maybe your coming to the valley really was fate. I wouldn't be surprised if I ever thought so too. Oh, ho. Perhaps this is Wesley's lesson just as much as it is yours. What can I possibly do to get through to Wesley? Wesley let his pride and duty get the better of him. He doesn't like to accept help either. He worked very hard to prepare your farm for you, did he? Did you know? No, I didn't know that. Hello, it was, what do you mean prepare? It was a goddamn mess. I've just done all the hard work. Are you going on about? <laughs> um. I was playing FM21 now for the past three versions, not been for me. Uh, Twitch streams are nice, especially when you meet camp people. Yeah, it's true. Uh, you know, like I mean, and, and, and I, I would, I, I would even go as far as anything, whether it be Discord or Reddit or Twitter or Instagram. It, it doesn't really matter. Um, I, I think it, there's there's a community for everybody, and um, if that's a nice, positive community you know that's i think that's a beneficial thing yeah for everybody you know what i mean uh obviously i think a lot, a lot it's easier to access that kind of positivity on switch i i kind of agree with that because it's actually it might be a bit hard to find that in other places because there's so many switch things and everyone seems really positive i don't think i've come across a negative stream yet I mean, there probably is. Do you know what I mean? It's really, there probably is a niche of negative streamers out there, but I've never met them or I've never seen them. Um, do you know what I mean? Like, it's not like a YouTube video where, you know, there is some negative YouTube videos and they're quite easily a able to find. Um, and, and again, obviously, with like Reddit, there's obviously some uh, negative, like, you know, people that have written stuff and stuff like that. And, you know, and, and it is that in every walk of life. Uh, but I think social media in the wall can be a big positive. It depends on what you're looking for. And, the, and again, I think it depends on the right community. Uh, I'll catch you all soon. I've got to be up at half six years for delivery of my bed from a relative, sadly. No problem, mate. Uh, yeah, true. Social media can have a positive reset uh, once you have the right community. Yeah. Uh, I put something on Reddit for a slightly older friend and first comment was so unnecessary. Well, this is what I'm trying to say about social media and it, it, it can be negative and it can be positive can't it and i think you finding the right positive is actually a, a more bene beneficial thing but sometimes a bit of negativity especially if it's like criticism and if you can accept that criticism it, it, it's like me now like you know and i tell people to, especially on my youtube it, you can't really do it here unless you tell, tell me in chat uh, like please tell me any negative comments please tell me how, how can i can improve you know i want to improve i want to improve my videos i want to improve my streams i want to you know to be the best i can i can be um so i i don't mind a bit of negative criticism now if it's really like you know going over the edge and really just like saying really nasty things about you 
that I don't accept. Do you know what I mean? Because there's no need for that. But I don't mind a bit of a uh, negative criticism. I think that can be again that can in, in for me that can actually spare me on a bit and go, okay, yeah, no, I'll take that in. I'll try and improve this and this and this. <laughs> You know what I mean? But yeah, good night, Duck, and uh, thanks for joining in the stream and in the chat. And yeah, carry on the good work, mate. Just carry on with the goals that you've set yourself. And, you know, like I said, if you, you know, if one week you don't hit that goal, just don't be, you know, looking at it and thinking, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm going to give it up. Just carry on the course, mate. Yeah, it's black hole. <laughs> it's, uh, there is too much unnecessary negativity. The thing is with negativity uh, and stuff like that, it, it, it sells unfortunately i mean it, it, it's like you know if you do a positive video on a negative video you're probably going to get more views on that negative video it, it's the truth because like a lot of people love drama and stuff like that and it, that's the unfortunate thing um but again i've got nothing against that that's people are quite within the rights to like that kind of uh, content i've got nothing against that and and you know and even myself i like sometimes i will watch a video that's kind of like critical against things whether i agree with it or not that's a different matter of opinion uh, i was asking about how reliable certain set a database for fm20 was for a person uh just to say that you really think something's gonna remember someone from so many versions go yeah no i i wouldn't i wouldn't remember anything like that mate uh, okay uh, the other saw a video about cat items to check the comment for some reason. <laughs> I've seen someone coming to that. Go to hell. <laughs> they might not like cats. I don't like cats. Uh, to be honest with you, I'm not a cat person. My son wants a cat. I like every cat I've come across has just been like. <laughs> like uh, I went, nah, I'm not having none of that. <laughs> you know what i mean but uh, i'm like i'm more of a dog person but even now like i don't really want a dog i don't want no pets to be honest with you <laughs> yeah you know what i mean but I, I, yeah I, there's no need for the comment like go to hell but i, I yeah you know what i mean it's one of them uh, for the moment i put the task on and wait, where's the work every single day to get home and the landing ready for you okay i mean it wasn't necessary no to be honest it wasn't it's about that uh no it was bad and funny at the same time yeah i, I think you've got to that's the thing isn't it it's how you take it in context like if someone says something how are they actually saying it are they saying it jokingly uh you know is it a meme you know kind of like a meme is it like are they just saying it because you know it, it's a funny thing to say or did they really mean it it's very hard to tell you know what i mean it, it's very hard to tell nowadays uh you know what i mean especially in the modern day media because like there is a lot of memes out there and there's a lot of you know funny things out there um but and it is very hard to tell if they're actually telling like if just joking around or they're actually being serious sometimes i mean sometimes you obviously know if they're being serious and if they, you know if they write like a foot longer about how they hate cats then <laughs> yeah you know that they're serious but if it's just like a comment like that you'd be like uh okay I love cats and dogs and almost any animals they're all amazing I, I to be honest with you I like all animals I just wouldn't have a cat like I just like I, like I said every cat I've ever come across well it might be just be me you know what I mean like every cat I've ever come across it's like <laughs> like you know what I mean uh, my friends my friends mum as well used to have like 21 cats that's probably what put me off like it was so like you couldn't move for cats honestly there was like there was cats everywhere like you know what i mean it's like okay this is crazy uh you know what i mean but yeah it was weird uh we didn't watch harm to any cats or any or any awful fate or anything no i wouldn't i mean there were, there were like i wouldn't wish harm on any animals look we're animals we're humans we are animals as well you know what i mean so i wouldn't wish harm on any 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 species of creature i would put it you know what i mean uh, tending to the ground or making the uh, old farm house a more comfortable abode uh, though he had quite the, com uh, the trouble dealing with how quickly the weeds would grow ho ho you you'd hardly believe he worked up a single sweat from the way he acted so really how there's something you could do to show my goodwill to navari that i believe is something my princess would never expect 
but I think it's something. I'll give him a present. That's obviously that has to be in, so you don't trust you right away. Yeah, yeah, I think that is the thing. Uh, once you've been in there, trust you'll be better about cards. Yeah. I, I suppose maybe I've just not given him a chance. Um, once I went out to my front door, and there was like seven of them just chilling in the yard and going, where's my food? Come on, I know you've got food. Give it to me now. <laughs> Uh, what have I got to do here? Hold on a minute. Oh, Wesley. Uh, if you insist on sending it, uh, then walk lightly in our grand tree. It isn't meant for outsiders. What? Uh, why'd you call me an outsider? Well, you're not from Navarre, are you? So you're an outsider. Ah. Oh. I have my own farm here. Maybe you do. But that doesn't mean you could possibly understand or appreciate our society. And if you can't understand or, 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 or appreciate it, how could you ever respect it? Yeah, true. Uh, is there something wrong with it? It's night out of fear to do my work here. Uh, what makes it so nice? Look around you. All the pieces of are coming here to enjoy themselves. You get to see almost everyone. Okay, whatever. So what do we need to do? Donate mana orbs at the donation box in the center of Novari. And that will make us him like me. So this box? I um, don't know if it's this box because I know you've got these things. Mana orbs in the donation box in the center of Novari. Right, so I think the sensor of it is in here. Ba -ba -bum -ba -bum, where about we want to chat? Uh, also, once my dad went to put something in the bin, I was quite, I was quiet. Open up the lid and the cat jumped out. <laughs> uh, I think this is the sensor, but I don't see any box. Oh, what is going on? What box? What box? Oh, hold on a minute, box. Oh, how many have I got? I got nine hundred and four. Hold on, one, two, three. Uh -huh. oh. All right, I need one hundred more orbs. All right, okay. That means I'm gonna do some tasks. Yeah. What it'll be is a bit like I am kind of racking, so it'll be the hunting for food. And then um, some people might not even realize it in there, and I'll shut the lids. And then, therefore, when your dad comes out, <laughs> opens up the lid, it's like. <laughs> but it does happen quite a lot. Okay, so we need so we need mana orbs. So we need to do these these to get mana orbs. You see, they'll they'll give us like you know forty five. Uh, about cats, I would like to recommend the movie which is called The Electrical Life of Lewis Wayne. Okay. Uh, to disable, I can't agree. What's British between? Uh, Fire crystals, earth crystals, water crystals. Uh, bring us to a beach. I think I've got that. Fire, earth, and water. Okay, let's try that one. Uh, fire, earth, and water crystals. I'm going to go check my box up, uh, in the base. If not, I'll have to go out and find them. What? Are you still here? You got, you got stuck. All right, whatever. Play up this land. Right, okay. Let me have a look in here. 
What was this again? Oh, I can, oh, hold on a minute. I can make mana as well. Oh, okay. What was it? Air, fire, and water. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. blah. Fire crystal, not a rune. Okay, not a rune. That's not in there. Mm. These are runes, not crystals. F. to go look for them we got nine days to do it okay that's not a problem it's about an artist who paints cats on how his art changing as his mental state's changing it's a slice of life charm and a kind of romantic ah oh, that's pretty good the only thing i've ever seen that was really good about a cat and I don't, you might have seen it as well. I'm not too sure. It's about a mu uh, musician, and, and um, it's like uh, it's like um, I think I think he's homeless, uh, but he's like busking on the streets. But it's like you know, it's not really going that great. And he, and he finds a cat. I think it's got Bob the cat or something like that. And then um, it's based on a real life story. Um, and then and then he starts like you know busking with the cat, and like just out of nowhere, he starts you know just, like really getting you know, like popular because of this cat. Um, that's quite a heart well uh, heartwarming story as well. I can't remember exactly what it's called. If I Google it now, I'll probably I'll probably find what it was called. Um Yeah, okay, so it's it's actually a book as well. So it's called a street name a street cat named Bob. Uh so I'll just put that in. Let's see and uh, so it's called a street Cat named Bob. So there you go, and you, it, it's, a, it's, it's a book, but it's also a movie as well. Um, it was a, so it, yeah. So it, it basically it says it's a a true feel good story about James, a busker and a recovering drug addict, and his life transformed when he meets a strange ginger cat really good one it's the only ever one i've ever seen that was actually like like you know kind of like what you're going on about there and um, you know actually improves his life and stuff like his mental health this is the kind of the same story but it's told in a kind of a different way and um, really really good you'll have to watch it it's actually really really good and you'll be like it's emotional as well so you like you might have a little tear in your eye when you watch it but, <laughs> but it's, it's really good actually we when you just mentioned that i was like oh yeah that reminds me of that that uh, film um it's very very similar in a way because obviously told in a different way and probably about a different subject but kind of very semi very similar right so we need uh, oh we got a oh we got a message hello Thank you. Oh, we, oh, right, okay. Oh, we're going to have to find these earth crystals, fire crystals, and water crystals. So I'm going to go back to my Sunhaven. Boom. So we're going to go back to our original village, which is here. And it's probably a good thing as well because we have got animals here as well. So hopefully they're not dead. Because <laughs> I don't, I haven't honestly got a clue when the last time I fed them. Um, no, we're we're all good there. Okay, they're all good. I swear we'll uh, get some eggs out while we're here. Uh, oop. So we've got some chickens. Uh, what are these uh, it's in here? Oh no, they're fine. They don't do nothing. They're just little animals that were in my way and I shoved them in the barn. We got our moo moo cows. Are they okay for food? They're okay for food as well. Okay, they're not starving. 
Uh, I wouldn't mind seeing these kind of movies though. Nice heartfelt, yeah. Uh, the one I recommend is uh, David Cumberbatch. Uh, Benedict Cumberbatch. Oh. Oh, I, I actually really love him as an actor. Um, yeah, yeah, I'll definitely give that a go then. He's actually one of my favorite actors. Um, obviously, because like, it might it might not be kid friendly. That's my kids don't watch them kind of movies anyway. <laughs> like, you know, I, you know what I mean. God, they wouldn't sit there and watch anything that I watch. Water my plant. There we go. Uh, is there anything else around here? That oh, okay. Okay. What did he need again? I can't remember what this guy needs. Uh, oh, we needed some wheat, some apples. All right. Oh, that's why I was growing the wheat. Okay, no problem. This game, this, 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 everything. Uh oh. Oh, what happened there to the stream? Oh, uh, hello. What happened there? Looks like a lost signal for a second now. Yeah, I went off. I went off for some time. Oh. Weird. Is it? Is it? Hello. Sounds. That's better for that. Looks. Let's let me have a look at the, how the quality of the stream is. Looks okay. Oh, weird. Too sure what happened there. Yeah, welcome back, yeah? <laughs> okay. We, we disappeared for about half a second. Well, as far as I know, anyway. Okay, so we've got two Earth Crystals already. We need Water Crystals. And we need Fire Crystals. Oh, look at this guy. There you go. You're going to give me a diamond? You know you want to. Huh? Yay, diamond! <laughs> God, a little mess. Uh, Alright. Where these uh, fire crystals are? Sword. That. 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 Five crystals around there. Fire crystals. Do 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 do. Whoa! Look at the hell! Huh? Huh? Yeah? Who do you think you are? Cheeky. Is that it? It's a beach. Yeah, it's just a beach. It's just a normal beach. <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> Welcome to the beach. You got all these uh, vermin after you. To be honest with you, it does say danger crabs. Uh, right here. Danger crabs. <laughs> it's just I'm OP at the moment. Well, I'm not I'm not that powerful, to be honest with you, but I'm, I'm too powerful them, for them. I don't remember what these uh, fire crystals are. Too sure. What are fire crystals and water? I know the water crystals are blue. 
I don't know what a fire crystals might be. I'm gonna go exploring. Nothing around there, okay. Back to the farm. Uh, we'll just drop off some of this stuff. There we go. to get back home uh no seeds so we just have foods we dropped off there okay there we go okay yeah <laughs> gives off dungeon vibes definitely I don't think I've even come across a dungeon on this game, to be honest with you. Oh, you know, there is, there is actually, there is, it's like, um, I, I need to do it actually, you just reminded me. Now I'm more powerful, I can probably do it. That's just whatever. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to do it in time, so I'll have to do it like in the morning. Sesame rice balls, no, it's nothing there. What are these uh, crystals? Like, they normally, they just like appear. I can't remember what the fire ones would be. Oh, those fruit trees, there, definitely. It's an it's a easy way of getting fruits in this game, just going around picking the trees, especially right at the beginning. Like, it's just super easy. Like, like, and it'll like, give you XP as well, so you can like level up on like um stuff. Like just literally just going on over shaking a tree and then picking it up. It's just that simple on this game. Um, there's a lot of stuff like this. Uh, actually, there might be crystals up here. I know I had the earth crystals. I've just put obviously I put them in my um my inventory so. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, hello. Oh, it's Amethyst. No, okay. Make a wish. Uh, nothing that way then. <laughs> Keep on exploring. We will find them. Sometimes you feel like four years old asking non-stop questions. No, I don't mind. I prefer people asking me questions, to be honest with you, because at least you're interacting with chat. Um, it makes my life a lot easier. It really does. You know, because if I've got something to look at and go, okay, they're asking the question and I've got to then think about it or come up with an answer, it's a lot easier for me than just randomly talking about crap. Which, again, it's not a bad thing some people are like that it's yeah the, i mean this just they are look at this this is just this village like you know it literally is and you know so you can go off this way this way up there as well and there's there's a lot to it and then you've got two two three other villages that i've not even explored yet ah this is what we needed water crystal right so we've got <laughs> two earth there's two water here so we just need fire i knew it was around here somewhere we just need fire crystals though which i'm not too sure where they are uh i think i found them before somewhere but yeah okay that's locked we haven't got any keys with us at the moment 
Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. It's huge, this game. So there's actually two of these games I didn't know. There's Sunhaven, which is more of your typical kind of farming sim, which is this, but there's a lot more to it than just farming. And then there's, um, I think it's called Moonhaven, not Sunhaven, I think there's, or something like that. I can't remember exactly. It, 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 this is enough for one to this, but it, it's more like a, kind of like a dungeon crawler in a way, um, which, yeah. So there's actually two different games um, made by the same people. Uh, I think the dungeon crawler one came first. If I'm, not, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it did. So we've got the earth ones again. So we should say the fire ones. Too sure what they would be. Just trying to look for them. Uh, no, it's not that way. Do to do to do. See some of these strawberries. Fire ones, fire, fire, fire. Okay, we've got this way. Let's have a look at what this way is. Uh, no, that's a water one. Not too bothered about the money bags. I mean, I could level up, I suppose. There we go. There we go, level that up. <laughs> Organize that. Some health down, some mana, yeah, okay. Ah, fire! Is that fire? No, that's not a fire. It is fire! Yay! We did it! We did it! Get out, get out, get out of my way. Come on then. Ooh, these are pretty hard. I might stay around here for a minute and just uh, maybe try and level up a bit. Ooh, these are actually pretty hard. These ones are really hard because they spit things at you. These ones are not so bad. Oh god, yeah, they're spitting things at me. Ah! Go, 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 go. You can adjust the game um, day. So I've got it on 20 minutes for a day. You can increase that to 40 minutes for a day. So it gives you plenty of time to explore. It's it, it's completely optional. Um, what you what you want as the daytime. Um, so 20 minutes is quite actually not so bad as you can see. It's like it's been quite a while since it's been like you know nighttime since we've last slept, and I've done quite a lot of exploring. It's only 10 past eight. I think we can stay up till 12 o'clock. Yeah, really for real. Yeah. So you can actually uh, it's in the game settings. It's so it's not like cheating. It's it's literally part of the game. Yeah, I think that's amazing too because then you can you can have it short as long as you you want um you know if you want a 10 minute day that's up to you but whoops wrong button <laughs> yeah so i think i think i've just got it on what it was set as and uh, well i think i'll just show you uh, i think it's there uh, it's one of these anyway I don't, i'm not too sure uh, there you go there you go. i can even i can even be invincible <laughs> if you, you know what I mean. Uh, so I can even be invincible. Didn't even know that. That, yeah. So yeah, I can be invincible if I really want to be. 
Yeah, there you go. There's the day. So you can go 20 minutes all the way up to 40 minutes long. So you can have it, you know, 10 minutes to 40 minutes. Uh, yeah, it could. De it's definitely more useful on dungeons because, like, I've actually fell asleep in a dungeon and I had to start all over again. And and how the dungeons work on here is like every couple of uh, every. Um, and I'll show you in a minute because uh, it's be easier to do it on a start of a new day. Uh, we'll go to a dungeon and I'll, and I'll show you the dungeons. Um, so how it works on this game is like you've got a dungeon run, but uh, it's like every ten or so dungeons you can get, you can earn a new chest. But the chests are not there; they're, they're right at the beginning. You have to go speak to a guy. So you've got to actually quit the dungeon run to do to get open up the chest. Uh, I know what first time I did it, I got up to like uh, some like level twenty, and I passed out in the dungeon, and they didn't give me any of the chests. I was like, oh, why is it not giving me an after chest? I've just done that. It's because I passed out. And I had to actually quit the dungeon to get it, or complete the dungeons altogether. So the next time I went in, I was like, right, okay. And I know what to do now. So yeah, turning it up would definitely be a lot, a lot easier because you could stay in the dungeons a lot longer. Also mining as well mining as a thing because unless you've got like like what i've got with a really good mining skill and a really good pickaxe and stuff like that mining can take ages <laughs> yeah yeah I'm, uh, I'm still pass out i'm not so bad on this game i'm passing out because on this game obviously in here it'll take you to the hospital and actually charge you money so i kind of got used to it a bit like uh, like i said about a bit like stardew where it charges you um if you pass out now obviously in the elf village it doesn't charge you which is actually a good thing so i can uh, i can stay awake i'm not too bothered about going to sleep in the elf village yet because they don't charge me um now i don't know whether they will do but in this village you, you end up in the hospital and it will charge you so i kind of got used to like going to bed at a reasonable time like if, in the, if i'm in the mines now as if i leave at 11 o'clock i will get home by 12 um because i can just use the skipping thing He lose gold and run in the mountains as well. I didn't realize that. I knew you, I knew the charge there. I didn't realize he'd lose random items as well. Damn, that is harsh. I mean, again, you've got the option on this, which I think is really good. If you go to your options, and I think you can actually turn that off. Um, pretty sure you can. I'm not too sure. Well, invincible. Yeah, there you go. Right. But I'm not too sure if you can actually just turn it off. Uh, monsters. Yeah, because you have monsters taking your crops. Uh, seasonal effects where you can, like, the effects can get uh, frozen. Uh, bosses. Uh, weather effects. Maybe not. Maybe not. But yeah, at the beginning of the game, I didn't realize that. So I was getting like, um, obviously it was, I was like in a bit like Moonstone where it was just passing out all the time. Uh, what did he want? Ah, he wanted 10 wheat. He wanted 10 apples. Now this is the cutest thing you'll ever see. So basically you'll feed him. And then he'll, he'll actually become a plushie. I've already got the plushie, so we won't become a plushie again. But I'll show you the plushies. So when you feed him, it'll shrink down. And I'll shrink down into a plushie. There he is there, the little purple one. <laughs> so as you can see, I've got a few of them that I've, I've, I've shrunk down. So that's the turn into plushies. Which is like, I think that's like super cute. Yeah, there he is there but yeah but the, i think they leave behind they don't turn into uh, plushies sorry they, they leave behind a little plushie but yeah and then they're there just then so you, you got to feed them to get them out your way but yeah 
Right, okay, I'll know that. Let's get these roses in. I'll s yeah, okay, I'm just, uh, that. Keep the health and the mana. Uh, the feed can go in. I think maybe the chickens or the cows. Not too sure which one need it more. What have we got? Ah, you, you're fine. You're fine. Yeah, it's you. These chickens eat so much food. I'm honestly, they're so hungry all the time. Right, yeah, yeah, we'll go do this dungeon. See, so I can't get behind there if I don't like, and I'll have to feed them some. So he wants uh, chocolate berries, which I might have some of them. Uh, mushrooms, berries, chocolate berries, and apples. Like, yeah, hold on, I'll, I'll go back a minute. Let me just, let me just see if I've, if I've got that. Uh, apples, yeah. Mushrooms, was it mushrooms? Yeah. I mean, I don't know if it was having I can't even remember what it was already. Oh, I know it was shocker berries and all that. Right, the berries as well. some shocker babies yeah I've not got a lot of animals um obviously I've got some what's it cows or sheep cows and sheep two cows two sheep just with a bit of wool and milk and chickens oh honestly the chickens with the uh, if you sell yeah you know, for instance if I if I go back in and I show you how much 50 eggs are worth they're worth thousands <laughs> like it's like the chickens I swear, do you know what? I absolutely swear. Hey, chocolate berries. Right, okay. I think I've got enough to feed this. Uh, just to, and it should, uh, hopefully it should shrink down just to show you, because it'd be good to show you like what it actually does. Yeah, but it, the eggs, so I, well, the eggs are the main ingredient for a lot of stuff, like bacon stuff and stuff like that, or like cakes and stuff. And uh, that's why I've only got like all just chickens. I've not really, I haven't really done a lot of farming on this game, to be honest with you, and, and stuff like that. Like I've just done what is necessary. I more just do the storyline. Bit like Moonstone, I wasn't really bothered about the farming element of it, just the storyline. Uh, okay, so let's. Uh, okay, what was it? Apples, yeah. Berries, yeah. Mushrooms, yeah. Chocolate berries, yeah. There we go. There we go. There we go. There you go. Look, little plushie. I got it. The Explorer Stacking Plushie. <laughs> And I think it should be up here sleeping still though. There you go, yeah, there it is. There it is sleeping. And then it'll open up this little or orchard. Uh, orchard, um, you got oranges and apples and stuff like that. 
But yeah, so yeah, just to show you like if you if I must have never done that one as well because a few of them I have not done like there's one up the top that needs like kale and stuff like that and cabbages and I've just not grown them they do look like Tulsa well. they do big time inspiration from that like you know what I mean I mean it's my one of my favorite characters of all time Tulsa well. um like, like I love I, I honestly I love that design um and I think these probably did as well, to be honest with you. They were like, yeah, what can we do? Yeah, Tulsa Rope. Yeah, we can. It will, we'll, we'll just change him slightly. <laughs> you know, a lot of games do that, though. Don't they take inspiration from it? You know, I don't see any problem in that. As long as it's not full on uh, copy off the characters and stuff. <laughs> something uh scythe the cock sword oh no okay that's fine yeah definitely yeah it's one of my all-time anime mangas i i honestly love that film Stop me now. It's not this way. Alright, is it, is it this way? This is the way to the elf farm and all that. I don't think it's this way. I think it's this way. That's back to the other farm. Rather than getting the griffin, you can walk it. Not that far. Uh, I think it's over this way, I'm pretty sure of it. Just open this. Ah, should get my pickaxe out. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, whatever. quite rare the peaches no um, you need some keys that's why I've not opened them ones that you've just seen I don't have any keys with me so some you'll need uh, bronze keys I have got bronze keys but they'll need like iron keys I already know because I've played the game for quite a while now so um, some will need like um, like adamant keys and mythical keys and you know so on and so forth uh, that's why you've, I've not opened them once because you can't well this was full of these well I just need these left oh. so I need to get to level 30 I'm gonna start on level 11 because no point in there starting on level one boom next level go
pads. Open. Can't see me, can't see me. Bye bye. <laughs> yeah, the game's honestly, it's really, really good. I've enjoyed it from uh, the minute I picked it up. Like, obviously, I started it, obviously, as soon as I finished Moonstone. So it was like, you know, it was just like a replacement for Moonstone. But, like, this is a lot more fleshed out than Moonstone. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, a Moonstone still getting added to. Um, I was checking on it the other day, and there's been a few patches and a few little updates. Nothing to, like, uh, you know, nothing to really go back for yet. Um, but it's still improving. Yeah, it's, it, I think it's a lot different than, like, you know, I, I, again, like, you know, you've got, like, your Stardew, and which is probably what most games are based on because it's so popular. Oh, crap. I forgot to heal. Ah, oh, I forgot, I forgot to heal. We got to heal. I can't do it again. You can only do one dungeon in one day. Fine. Whatever. Now oh, let's go um, back to the other village and uh, drop off these uh, crystals that we needed to do. And then we should get enough mana for the donation stuff as well. I uh, wouldn't think it was uh, that could be different. Yeah, so it doesn't seem like those old spaceship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a good, uh, good uh, observation that they kind of do feel like that actually. Like, like let's say, yeah, uh, five at you from all different directions. I totally forgot to uh, heal myself up then as well though. <laughs> I need these berries to feed me. Um, my bed. Hopefully it's not too tired to travel, because sometimes it can get too tired to travel. But then we have to wait another day. I know, it's still up, still up. There we go. And we go to the farm. Yep, boom. Doing this too. Willow. We're going to find Willow. Wait a minute. 
Did they? Right, okay then. Oh, I need to fire. What's a minute? Oh, I must have. Did I put all that stuff back? Oh my god, I'd sorted it all out, didn't I? Like a stupid idiot. We gotta go back. Oh my god. I was wondering why I couldn't do the mission now. Sorted it all out on me. Cute. Ah, come on. Really? Oh. I can't believe I put it back in. I can't believe I put them in my chest. Oh my god. You're so stupid. What do we need out of them? game about a uh, spaceship is chain aliens ah uh, looks like it's budgy i do you still have the game still i have it on my laptop i'll play it sometimes okay i might as well go to sleep i need to go back to the village now and get what i've what i put in my chest i forgot Like, oh, I need some babies as well. I did that. <laughs> yeah, take me back. I know. Stupid. Where did I put them now? I don't know where I put them. No. 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 I think I put them inside the house. Inside of the house, and more stuff. Oh, oh, must have been in here, mustn't he? Crystals, yeah. Right. Yeah, okay, right, now turn into Willow. Right, okay, right. Honestly god. She stupid. Yeah, it is my house, yeah. Gosh. Well, I've got two houses. I've got one here and, a, and I've got one at the elf farm. So this is obviously my house as well, what they've given me. Uh, and that house they've given me as well. So basically, I've not I've not built these houses. You can upgrade the houses though. Uh, on this game, you've got to go get a permit. 
then you've got to buy the permit and then and then you've got to hire somebody to come and build, like build the upgrades which is like 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 it's well they are expensive to build the upgrades but i've not felt like i needed to do that yet um even to fish as well like you need, you need a permit to fish you need a permit to use nets uh, <laughs> But you sometimes sleep somewhere else that's why i got confused yeah because you can sleep at this farm and i can sleep at that farm so they're both your houses yeah it's like having that it's like having a tent isn't it on moonstone we can put it anywhere and if it went and um, where you see the fog puzzle here i'm not but uh, i'm not being i'm not being and done it that'll lead me to another city where there'll be another farm um, so we can have three farms on the go, but I've not done that yet because I don't want to I want to try and do this a bit more of this first and try and like level up and get uh, You know a bit more stuff in so I'm a bit more more powerful Yeah, I didn't know about other cities on this game until until like recently Like they was like, oh, oh no, there's other cities go and explore and go and find them and I was like, and then I found it Like this was actually really hard to find originally because of like things blocking the way and stuff like that You had to do loads of stuff uh, to even get in here because it was like, as they said, it was hidden Um, so you had to do loads of stuff, you had to, like I said, these uh, trees you had to bring back to life to, to let you in um, And all this kind of stuff, so it was actually hard to get in this village A stranger, why am I farmer? Why'd you ask? Do you grow corn? I like corn a lot. Yeah, I can grow loads of corn. Oh, that's great. I fly into your corn farm sometimes and I, and I have some corn. Uh, it's pronounced farming. Ah, who cares? Yeah, uh, who's Wesley? Oh, see ya. Okay. Are you a fast swimmer? I bet you're even faster than Mel Cell I was. Yeah, the crossbow man is swimming fast. You used to be a swimmer. You used to be faster. That's what it says anyway. Okay, whatever. What do you mean? You used to be faster. Legs don't work. Don't work like you used to. Or maybe it's his knees. Tell me. Okay. Uh, what makes you ask? I want to go swimming, but I can't. Because my wings won't work anymore. So I ask people to go swim themselves. Um, if you could, I bet you'd be a fast swimmer. I think so too. I'm the fastest fly for my sisters. Okay. Just soaking nonsense there. Alright, okay. Yeah, what do you want? Mana orb. Right. How many mana orbs have we got? Oh, God's sake. We only got 51 off that. That is not a lot of mana orbs we need. How many do we need? Enough for 50. God damn it. What else can we get? Three bark fish. Maybe. I lost myself in the moonlight last night. I realized I've never tried Dragon Gulper before. It would be wonderful if someone could help me bring a Dragon Gulper to try tonight. And of course, I'm a ward then. So we want two fish. We want three bark fish and a Dragon Gulper. I mean, I'll try. Okay, I guess we go fishing. Um, sound like a lullaby to my ears oh i better go to sleep <laughs> good night oh have a nice sleep uh, we'll be streaming again tomorrow uh, have a good night polly it's nice to see you and chat and again here about we can probably yeah see you again soon boom perfect what's that flame fish
is an overwater source. Well, maybe there. Some there. Some there. Oh, do you know what? Let's go over here to where it's more water. Might be a bit easier. In some of the Grand Tree. <coughs> Yeah, okay. It's a different place, I think it's a different place. Not there. Yeah, dear. Um. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, it's um. place to get fishes around here. Especially the fish that we need. Uh, ah, see, yeah, there is more fish around here. Fishing section somewhere. 
Uh, yeah, here. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's not really water, though. It's a water, but I don't think you can fish there. So there's only going to be two regal fishing places. So where are we going to be here? Which is like, okay. Ah, actually, hold on a minute. I think we can fish at our farm as well. Pretty sure of it. Oh, we can't even. Oh, I see one. Barkfish. I think barkfish were just in the in the in the other place. I'm pretty sure of it. Um, I actually can't remember. I'm pretty sure I've had barkfish before. Dragon Gulper, so... Sorry. Unicorn fish. Everything else other than this Dragon Gulper? What is it? It's one of them. Uh, Sensical monster emblem. Okay. It's cool. I suppose. We need a track and go per. Track and track and track and go per. We'll fish all night if we have to. Track and go per. Come on down, I need you. Perfect. Playing fish. I need them. Oops. 
Ooh. That's a fast one. Fast. Oh, my God. Come on, I'm going to get you. Got you. Oh, it's you again. Uh, I might as well come back another day. Definitely not like that. What, uh, what the hell? I'm wrong way, wrong way. Yes, we would like to sleep. Mm, nice. Okay. stuff we got. Okay. Good. As well, see if we can go and get a bit of fishing rod as well because it might help. Oh, hello. Oh, hey there. That may sent me to round you up. What's going on? What else to say? It's really urgent that you get over to the tavern. We may or may not have something really special planned, eh? Maybe it wasn't allowed to say that. Oh, it's my birthday again. That's right, come on down since you can. Of course, we'll understand if you can't make it. We spent all night setting up for you. Oh, maybe I wasn't allowed to say that either. Oh, come on down, won't you? I'll be standing out front of the tavern waiting for you. Just talk to me when you're ready, all right? Uh, you should maybe make sure you have plenty of inventory space for all the things. You should get... Oh, uh, okay, I'll get this as soon as we can. Blah, blah, blah. Okay for foods? Nah, okay. Do a little bit more there. It's fine now at the moment.
let's get this over and done with. Honestly. We're going to the tavern. Uh, actually, let's drop off all these fish first. Just so that out of my inventory. Dragon Gulper, okay. Well, I mean, that's what we need anyway, isn't it? So, everything else is like, okay, whatever. There we go, a couple more things there. Uh, what, what season we even in? Spring. Never know. Nothing. Um, yeah, here we go. Here we go, Ronald. We're in. Come on, give me surprise birthday. I'm guessing it's my birthday. Uh, I don't know. Okay, what is it? I used to blah, 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 put it on. Blah, blah. Happy birthday. Alrighty, take off my blindfold. What is it? Oh, what a surprise! It's my birthday! I'll ambush, I'm gonna start blasting! <laughs> okay, okay, go on, which one surprise you want me? Oh, I didn't realize it. Oh, wait, it's my birthday today? Oh, yeah, yeah, I didn't know. Didn't you know? No, I didn't even know. Did that kick for me? Yeah, yeah, blow it out, allow me. Come on, blow out the candles. I think if the, I think if I blow out the candles, it's the day over. I'm pretty sure it is. What are you selling? Buy a birthday dress. Should we buy a dress? <laughs> Wait, there's nothing else here. Uh, let's blow out the candles. Yeah, we're, we're, we're ready. Let's get it done and dusted. Get it today over and done with. Uh, what shall you wish for? Uh, find gold on a mine. Oi, let's. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, bye, everyone. Yep. No, oh, I'm ready to leave. Oh, God damn it. Oh, it's a god damn, what a waste of a day. I need it to fish. What oh, a waste of a day. I, need, I should have fished first. I should have fished first. What a waste of a day. I should have fished first and then went to him at the end of the night. Oh my god. What a waste of a day. I'm sorry. Oh, I need to know how much um, this rod is. Yeah, 
fish seller. Gold fishing rod is 10 grand. Alright, okay. We can do that. We've got 6 grand now. Seahorse. Well, let's add two of them. Oh my god. I think the, um, the sea is a little bit different. All right, have we got bait? I don't want to shock any bait or anything like that. What have we got? Mm, got no baits. It? I think I can do it. I need bait. I, have got, I think I've got worms somewhere, but I'm too sure. We got bark fish from here. As well, I can't believe I'm missing it. I can get you. Thank <laughs> you. 
There we go. of water source um I think maybe it was up here pretty sure there might be a water source down here if maybe there was bark fish down here I, can't, I honestly can't remember fishing place down here i'm hoping this is where we get them from i can't remember uh, sandstone fish okay so maybe not be back fish i'm not too sure Sandstone fish in here, it might be. Yeah, it might be. Um, I may pop it as well. Of um, like the legendary stuff ones, so it might be what I need for the dragon ones. I'm not too sure. I think it can be quite a lot of XP, though. It's only fish, uh, Samsung fish. I mean, I could level up pretty easily doing that. I need to, I think I've only got four days to find these fish. Uh, I actually can't remember where they might be. I think there's another place, um, not there, but I think it's, it's over this way. Um, 
I'm going over there this way and out of the village. I think there's a water place that I can fish in. I'm pretty sure of it. Well, yeah, the uh, Right. Is there anything spawn in there? Guess I'm not. Oh yeah. Same place as that. 
Where the hell do I find this part? I've not found one before. Makes me wonder if it's like a seasonal fish. I don't know, I might have to check. If it's just a fish or it's a seasonal fish. They go to the museum, I think it might be shut now, like, but, um, I'm not too sure. I'll be open. No, it hates lights, okay. Yeah, I can go this way. Please, man. Fish is coming tight up in the valley. Oh, hold on. Maybe in the, I'm in the wrong place then. Right, maybe that's where I caught location forest. Right, okay. What was the other one? Dragon Gulper. Town farm farm forest as well. It's a rare type, but it can be called during all seasons. Mm -mm -mm. Uh -huh. Uh, okay, so we've got a spot. So we've got forest, the farm, and the town. Right. So we can either get both of them from the forest, uh, and this one in and farm. Okay. All right. We got some going back there then tomorrow. Um, I tell you what, then let's just sell all this stuff. It's like I don't care about the fish. We we'll just get more fish. Uh, So, so. Yeah, I don't know, actually, I keep them just in case, because, like, I can, I can, I can put all them in there. Uh, Okay, so, right, so forest, the town, all the place. Okay, okay. Should have sold some stuff as well, actually. Made to get that golden uh, rod. Okay, it's 8 o'clock, isn't it? So. Uh,
Let's go and sell some stuff because we need. We could do with that uh, golden rods. Okay, no problem. Okay, let's just go and drop these off and I think that'll be the end of the stream. Let's go quickly, sell all this stuff. That, 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 that. 37,000 pieces of eggs. Oh my god. Eggs are OP. Oh my god, I'm gonna be rich. Stop for eggs. in here oh, we've got something now um yeah, spring okay we got one come on out of all these hey you're joking aren't you honestly It's weird. It's so weird that um, all these are like nothing. Okay, might as well sell them. Unless it can go in here for some, I'm not too sure. Alchemy. Start. 
bundle, crops bundle, spring crops. We should be not really bothered with any of that yet. But this is obviously mining, so I'm just going to get a guess and no golden bundle. Yeah, that's just all. Yeah, not yet. Um, okay, might as well just sell all this then, or, or, or turn it into animal feed, I suppose. Another thing we, we can do with that. Five apples. You know. Grab a chest plate. Okay. Well, it's got five apples right now, so don't do that quickly. level up so let me just get these apples off this tree that should just do it what did I tell you I thought you'd probably do it Under 40 grand there. Go. Oh, level on that. Let's just drop some of the stuff off in here, I suppose. That, 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 that. I don't know, we need that. That, that, that. Go. No. Right, okay, we might as well then start fishing. Uh, to the farm. Right, so it said here. Uh, what was it? And. Right, so both to the forest, so we need to go to the forest. So let's go to the forest. We need to find a water source near the forest. So. So this is the forest. We need to find a water source like here. Let's do it. Level all up.
sounds more like it spawns there. Is there a map? Oh, yeah, we're really good at map. Right, don't really have a map of the forest, so I'll have to just look around. Naturally spawning um, stuff. Maybe that far. Oh. to find them in the forests so it's that one kelp eel as far as i know this might be the only fishing place as well so can find out a bit of mana. Probably sell stuff for mana, to be honest with you. That fungus fish, god damn it. And then, uh, what a cast that was. Come on. No. Okay. Oh, wow, 
we got a dragon gulper. Oh my god, we just need bark fish. That's a lot all. We need three of them as well. Uh, we got so we've got the hardest one. Playing fish. There's one. Right, we got two bark fish. Okay, I didn't realize we had two. Unless we just put two down, two at once. Packs a lot all. The hell? Oh, what happened there? Fungus fish. Uh, don't know why that was booting up. Okay. One more, one more, please. Well, that was slow. What the hell is that? A leaf one? Okay, we got two of them gulpers now. So need some more, but one more bark fish. Come on, come on, we can do it. I want to come back another day. until we pass out if we have to might make more sense give me a bit more time yes got it oh nice we'll get the last one
Well, I've wasted the year to be honest with you. Oh my god, how much? Oh my god, oh my god, like in the 50 grand off that. It's crazy, just a fish. So, it does have eggs and fish, yeah. Let's go hand all us in. And then, like I said, we'll uh, have to save it there. Alright, so we've got Opal and Wesley. Wesley, I think, is here. I'm not too sure who Opal is. Oh, that's, no, that's actually Willow. What the hell was it, minute? J, is it J? L. Uh, uh, Opal is a. F uh, I don't know where Opal is. Where's Opal? The thing that doesn't tell me who anyone is on this one. Like on the other one, it tells me like who who to. That's silent. Might be all in here then. Be sure. Ah, okay, there's one. No problem. One minute, let me just let me do this as well. Now I've got it, and then it saves me going back again. Ah, Colonel, what are you doing in the sound donation box? Uh, what are you buying? How much in the donation box? But why? I need to be paid back for the work I did on your farm. I did what I did because it was uh, Elder Goldwyn's ass for me. I wanted to give the rest of the valley and to thank you. Um, well, yeah, thank you. As well, is there anything else I can do for you? Ah, uh, thank you for the generous donation, but I'm far too busy to be messing around like this. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, if you have to ask, I'm working on a story in an old poem that was written in the ancient Bavarian language. Something only I can handle, which means I'm not going to get any help, so I appreciate you not wasting my time on ancient poem, you say. Yeah, it's written in the old song, which so old that he'll go and compare to speak or, or read a bit. What I'm getting at is there's no way someone like you could possibly help me out. Um, I have an idea. Let's do this one first, um, and then we can always go back uh, back to him another day. Should be around here in here somewhere. Yeah, okay. Mm, oh, 
Bob Chrono, you put me to fish, I accidentally hit your pain with something else, I no problem. I will probably do more fishing. You know, I nearly got uh, know, a little bit of honey now. Okay, one little bit more fish then. Okay, then probably go up to 30 then. Come on, little fishy. Are you going to be number 30? There you go. Here we go. Expert angler. to the library and we're probably just going to save it there like i said so at least we know where we're going what we're doing for next day uh, next time we're on this i was play i've been missed actually playing this game it's like um I, re I really do actually enjoy playing this game save it there <sighs> I'm not gonna be over reading anyone tonight um so yeah I'm just gonna leave it as that uh thanks uh, for joining in tonight I'm just going to quickly go to my channel and I'm just going to quickly check uh, what we're streaming for tomorrow because I actually can't remember. Okay, we're on Sea of Stars. So that'll be fun. That'll be fun. Uh, okay, there is Pink Mosh, uh, Pink Moshi there. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe we can... Um, And we can we can quickly uh, go on radar. Yeah. Okay. We'll we'll quickly radar. Okay, anyway, uh, thanks to everyone uh, joining in. Uh, see you stars tomorrow. Uh, so we'll, we'll have some good fun on that. Anyway, reading now. Uh, Pink Mochi, we'll leave you with her for tonight. Uh, have fun. Oh, one one zero zero. Yeah, I don't know. Did that not work? I will try that again. Chrono Pixel, hi hi. Welcome oh, back. it's it. How's your day going? How was your stream? <laughs> I don't know if my raid yesterday worked. <laughs> Thank you, Christine. Stars, we got one star. 
your stream. Oh, my, my Passover worked? Oh, thank goodness. I like ended the stream and I could not tell if all the people went over or what happened. But I'm glad to hear that it worked. <clears throat> We're playing an old school, old school, old school one. Yeah, I did. Uh, so I left... Uh, I left the game up for a while watching his, but then um, I ended my own stream and I wasn't sure if I could end it without um, stopping the raid. And so I wasn't sure, but what I ended up doing is I ended the stream and then I just left my... So I watched it while I was getting ready and then when I left, I left it on the stream so he still had the viewership. Okay, so once you hit raid, you can end it after that. I'll print on the front of the box. Thank you, Christy. Uh, spiked balls right here. Yeah, if you want us the people you raid with, can stay. 